Welcome. This video is to provide helpful guidance for remote workers for chat and SMS. I'm going to explain the administration configuration requirements and end user experience when working as a remote worker. For SwitchVox phone users to use SMS messaging, SwitchVox admin needs to do these things. You have to sign up for SIP station service with SMS capable numbers. You have to set up your switch files <coughs> with a SIP station VoIP provider and you need to set a SIP phone extension to use an SMS DID. If you need assistance signing up for SIP station service, please call 877-344-4861. SIP station will provide you a key code. Now you need to Go to admin page and you need to set your SIP trunks. Navigate to setup. Click on VoIP providers. Uh, I have already my SIP station trunk set here, but I'm going to show you how you can do that. Click on SIP station setup. And copy the key code that SIP station provided you here. And you need to set a callback extension number when someone calls your DID number, you, uh, that call will go to this extension and create income DID routes. Click on complete. I did that already, so I'm going to show you what you have to do after that. Once you add your SIP station trunk, you will see them under SIP provider. Click on edit for these two SIP trunks. SIP station will provide you two trunks and they will provide you a username and password. Username is set by default here already. You have to enter your password and you have to save your SIP provider. Here you need to point this um, SIP station to this, this trunk to uh, an extension. I'm going to use 504. Edit SIP station to and enter your password here too and save the SIP provider. Now, click on server, click on IP configuration, change allow NAT port, for, port forwarding to yes. You have to enter the external IP address here, look up the external IP address, click insert external IP address, click on advanced, and add a host name here and click on save. Now click on income set up incoming calls. Click on SMS rules. I already have my rules here, but you're going to add create an SMS DID. DID number is the DID SMS DID number you um, have from SIP station for your SMS service. In my case, it's 289-800, and I have that already. And you need to send that DID number to an extension. That extension would be the extension that user can use to send SMS or receive SMS. And you have to use a SIP provider. Use SIP station number one because SMS works over SIP station number one. Now I'm going to show you what you need to do to provide chat feature to your users. By default, chat feature is available for uh, users, for any user on local network or remote user. But as, an ad, as admin, you have to make sure um, you have the external IP address set on your server. Go to server, IP configuration, Make sure you have your external IP address set here. If you don't know what is the external IP address, click on look up external IP address and insert your IP address here. Click on advanced option and enter a host name here. If you want to give your users to use this host name, not the IP address of your PBX. And then go to server, access control, and make sure for all network 0000 slash 0, web user portal is set to on 
and user API is set to on and make sure web admin portal is off for our network. SwitchVox provides you multimedia chat. It means you can chat with your customers or your partners out of your network. Click on start a guest chat and click copy link to clipboard and send this link to your partner or your customer or anyone outside your network you want to chat with them. They can use that link. They can chat with you. Get their message. You can send a message and you will see guest user has connected to the chat. Or they can share their screen. Click on a screen. They will be asked to download Chrome extension to share their screen with you. Or they can click on video to make a video call. You can decline this call or you can accept that. To chat to your coworker, you can either chat through your web portal or you can use your SwitchVox soft phone. Open your browser, get access to your web portal, enter the IP address of your PBX slash main. If you don't have this information, please contact your admin. Enter the extension and enter password. Sign in. Click on the extension. Click on chat and type your message. If you want to use your desktop phone, open your desktop, enter your extension, enter password, sign in. Click on chat button here. Click on plus, click on chat. Search the extension you want to chat with them. Or you can find them here if you already had a chat session with them. And type your message. Click on go. You can send SMS to external numbers by your SwitchVox phone. Click on chat. Click on plus. Click on SMS. You will only see SMS option here available if you are using SIP station trunk enter your number here if you do, if you have to enter any digit before your number like if you have to add nine and then enter your number you have to add it here too and click on go